eBay is no longer providing seller protection for all of your late shipments starting today, October 1st. You may have noticed that up until now, they were very, very generous by not affecting your seller performance on all of your late shipments. And there were a lot of late shipments because of the shipping carriers, all due to the COVID-19 situation. We already know about all of that. But do not panic because in this video, I'm going to go over exactly what this means, what changes you need to implement in your store so that your seller account will not be affected by this. So just watch this quick intro and let's begin. Hello everyone, my name is Liran from AutoDS. I'm the content producer. I've been dropshipping for the last four years. And before we begin, I highly encourage you to like this video because it really helps out our channel. Share this video so that your friends and family will also see what dropshipping is all about. And subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you can always stay up to date on all of the news, updates, and all of the cool stuff that's happening in the dropshipping industry. So without further ado, let's see what all the fuss is about with eBay not giving out any more seller protection for your late shipments. So a little history lesson first. You may have noticed that in all of the past months, starting from March or April, eBay started sending out messages to your inbox about giving you seller protection for late shipments because they know that shipping carriers are having a really hard time getting out their packages on time. So most deliveries are either being canceled, seriously delayed, or are just getting lost somewhere along the way during transit. And up until today, nobody knows where those packages are. So this is all of the mess that us sellers were going through during the COVID-19 pandemic with the shipping carriers and eBay noticed this. They didn't want to lose their sellers due to below standard seller performances because of late shipments. So what they did is they just came out and they helped by sending messages like this. This is the last one that we got in the beginning of September. They were sending out these messages all throughout the pandemic starting in March or April. So basically what eBay was sending in these messages to the sellers is, Hey guys, we're removing the late shipments. As long as you upload a valid tracking information, even after the shipment is late, we won't consider it as a late shipment under your account. As long as you provide a valid tracking number, even for cases which were closed not to your favor, which affected your seller account, just upload a valid tracking number and we will waive that case closed not to your favor from your account so you won't go below standard. Even in your item not received in your service metrics, we'll waive all of that. Just provide valid tracking numbers. That's all that we ask. It can be as late as you want just provide it. And even if you got a negative or neutral feedback from one of your customers because of the shipping and delivery time, we'll waive that from you too. Just let us know. So now eBay is not giving us all of this anymore. They're just coming and saying, Hey guys, we're pausing all of the late delivery protections that we gave you up until today. And that is because we are seeing a huge increase and a huge improvement in the delivery times by all of the shipping carriers. So now that eBay is not offering any more seller protection for late shipments because they see that the shipping companies are shipping out the products on time, it is our responsibility as sellers to make sure that our seller accounts are not affected and to maintain them in a healthy status. So all that you need to do is update your shipping policies to be compliant with what you can really handle today regarding shipping times so that your customers will know exactly what to expect and so that there won't be any more mistakes. So all that you have to do is head into eBay. Go to your account settings. Click on business policies. And in the business policies, you'll see all of your policies, shipping policies, return policies, payment policies, and so forth. Just click on shipping, click on the shipping policies that hold your listings. Once inside, you can change the handling time, delivery time, and so forth. Now, what's important to note about this new update is eBay still doesn't care if your shipment is delivered late, as long as your handling time is on time. The difference between handling time and delivery time is that the handling time is how long it takes you to provide a tracking number, a shipping label, and the delivery time is how long it will take to reach the customer. So the delivery times can still be delayed. eBay is still not looking at this under a magnifying glass, but you do have to handle your product on time, which means upload a valid tracking number on time. This is what's important now. So you have the services. This is how long it will take to reach the customer, regardless of the tracking number. 
and you have your handling time, which is what I just talked about. This is what's important now. You have to ship out your product on time. So whatever time it takes you to upload a tracking number, this needs to be your handling time and make sure that it's correct. Anything above three business days is not typical by eBay, which means your listing will have not a high visibility like having three or less. So if you can handle less than four business days, go with three two or one but this is always very risky because if you're not going to upload your tracking number in one or two business days then you're going to get late shipments and like we talked about ebay is not going to give us protection for this so make sure that this is on point the handling time is very very important so make sure that that is correct you have your services which is once again how long it will take to reach the customer regardless of the tracking information just make sure your handling time is correct once you're done with that click on save and that's it so the only difference is you could have put one business day during the whole time that we had the COVID situation. You could have taken advantage of this. Viewers would say, wow, this seller is going to ship it to me in just one day. I'm going to have a tracking number. This is really, really fast. I'm going to buy from this guy. And then you're going to provide your tracking number after four or five business days. eBay would not do anything about it, but now they are. So once again, make sure that this information is precise. This is what's going to protect you from getting a bad seller performance due to late shipments. Once again, make sure it is precise and exact because starting today, October 1st, this is the most important thing to keep a high seller level. So that pretty much sums up eBay's new policy, what we're gonna do about it to maintain a healthy seller account status. Once again, if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comments below and I will personally answer them. And I highly encourage you once again to like this video because it really helps out our channel. Share this video so that your friends and family can also learn about dropshipping and all of its advantages. And subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can always stay updated on videos like this because I upload them on the regular. So until the next time guys, bye bye.